Hello guys, you are watching Droid Gun, I am Lokesh Kapoor and in this video we are going to talk about Certwatch software. Certwatch is a rank tracking software and I bought the software last year in November uh, in a Black Friday deal from AppSumo and uh, it came to me like a surprise and I am just getting a lot of benefit from this software so I just wanted to share all the benefits that I am getting with the software with you with this video so you may also get some benefit from this software so we will talk about uh, how you can achieve a lot with this tool so let's hop to my dashboard I have already opened up my dashboard for you here you can see I have already added three projects of mine and here you can add your own project just write your name of the project search engine you want to track domain of your project frequency yeah you have to just focus on this if you click on you know uh, every three days and the data will be updated like uh, every three days so I am using daily so my data is updated daily okay here you can add few keywords mm, you can also leave it or write one keyword and you can add keywords later here you can just write keyword suggestions here the location you can just remove this from here and write your own location and it will be searched like that okay and track local results the good feature for local listings websites or anything you can just uh, move to a lo precise local location location from it it's a beta feature they are working on it very hard and from here you can choose the location uh, sorry language and just click on share project is this at this place in case you are adding some keywords like any keyword keyword one keyword two with a space and uh, comma you can add multiple keywords and if there are a lot of keywords and you have already those keywords in your sheet csv file then you can simply import all those keywords from this button right below when you click it it will ask you to drag or click to upload file and you can upload the csv file and it will be added in column or row whatever it is so this way you can just create a project once you have created a project it will show right here in the projects row and you can just see this project window right here it will show me the search domain like uh, the uh, location it's tracking if it is India uh, most probably it will track from uh, google.com and if you are like using France that google.fr so this way it just changes to search engines and text your keywords for that specific you know location and you have to just choose it uh, this will show me the average position of my keywords that I have added right here you can add your keywords from this button right below and here too you can use uh, multiple keywords and import a csv file to add many keywords as you want and by clicking on this button you know uh, it will it will not be clickable so uh, you just uh, it just shows you the average position of it, uh, keywords below right here and by clicking this button it will you know add a filter to it like those which are moved up is one keyword so it will show me that keyword only which is moved up okay and here by clicking this one it will show you all the keywords which are not changed keywords without change so all those keywords which are not changed the position of which are not changed here you can see the change current position last position so there is no change six to six it was six and it is six so there is no change so it is uh, showing me under keywords without change so these are all the keywords which have the same values in their current and last so there is no change in them and showing me in this filter no, right here so and uh, here this the same way which are moved down uh, the value of current is uh, you know above or larger than the last one so all those keywords will be shown in this filter and you can also use this filter from here okay you can filter it by name and hit enter right ideal hit enter and it will be popped up like here so keywords in top 3 by clicking that it will show you those keywords 
right here but i have also you know, used ideal so ideal is not in top 3 so that's why it is using two filters at the same time so you have filtered from there and you can also search in then it will be an extra filter a layer of filter over it so i will remove it and then hit enter then it will show me all the keywords that are in top 3 so this way you can uh, use the software and keywords in top 10 all those keywords project value all that and here it is showing a graph that is uh, showing me the algorithms updates over time by clicking on it it will show you all the details about the algorithm from some sources uh, there are multiple sources uh, that are integrated to just show you this information right here in this pop-up window you can close it and from this you can just, you know uh, see like whether your project is doing well after an update is hitting so if it is going down then you may suspect that yeah this is the update due to this update you are falling down from the search engine so you can just work on that update you can see what is this update about you can search on you know various uh, forums and see whether uh, there is something you are missing or your website is lacking so you can work on it to just improve this thing uh, there are some new features search watch features like how many images in the search results are there how many paid keywords there is no paid keyword there is no video ranking featured snippet there is no content features snippet there is no content in you know FAQs answer box knowledge graph google reviews and people ask so these are rich meta uh, you can search google rich results so it will show you all the documentation about all these things so this is not documentation here is all the documentation so these are the results which we were talking about right here right this is uh, not exactly what they are talking about but yeah most probably they interlink with this thing so you can uh, check out this link or you can search the keyword that I searched and that was google rich results so uh, moving on here we have some analytics you can you know uh, integrate your own google analytics account uh, here to see the analytics of your website right from this tool okay so this is not you know done we can also click on a specific keyword that we have added right here from this window or from the project added window so now if i click on this keyword it will show me a lot detail about that specific keyword like uh, all the basic things these you can also see from the dashboard of your project itself but below are the you know results that are changing over time with day to day basis you can also see all these things if we click on them it also shows you an image So if you like click on them So right this is how it works for the keywords there are also some other tools like uh, creating you know uh, project reports for your projects let's get back to our project right click here and click on project report choose the domain you want choose the interval you can choose any interval it may be the date of 
new region today yesterday last seven days 10 days month and you can also choose the custom range for this and hit on apply you can uh, you know retrieve your uh, report in simple pdf format extended pdf format csv file extended csv file just hit on any of these formats and just uh, choose the keywords you want uh, here it's showing me all those keywords but none of them is selected actually so if you want to you know create a report for any keyword you have to click on it and then to be selected right here in this active uh, you know uh, color is changed so you can from there recognize that it's selected to select all of these just click on this button and all the keywords under that project will be selected if you choose uh, another domain these keywords will be changed accordingly so that you can change the keywords of that project and hit on make report so when you click on make report a pdf will be generated and downloaded right here which you can see here it is the selected keywords right here and the data with respect to the change currently last in best results you can also go to their customer support for uh, any information here's the forum and here's also a roadmap they're working on the features they're working on right all these things you can check from here you can also join the affiliate program if you are an affiliate want to earn something and uh, you can also uh, manage your clients under clients management so when you have bought your tool and you want that uh, more people may join your tool so i you have to just click on this uh, toggle button this will enable client management system under your dashboard and i have already filled up all the information so with respect to the name of my agency whatever it is <coughs> and you can also choose a subdomain for your you know uh, client project setup so just copy this i show you so it works like that tradekinch.surpwatch.io so i also show you So this is my dashboard here there's no project in my system and i even can't create any project so what's the use of it let me tell you you can not you know add any project from here you need to go back to your projects but before i tell you that thing uh, let me complete this thing so here you can just uh, use the logo so that is shown right here and right here at fabcon and that logo here and that logo here it's just this logo only okay uh, you can also uh, choose a theme for your you know client dashboard if you click on it right here and save this you will notice a change let us check it so according to that theme uh, the client dashboard has been changed so uh, I just don't want to use it anymore and you can also customize uh, from here just go on custom choose these colors and it will be changed accordingly to one that colors uh, now let's uh, complete that thing now how you can add projects so just go to dashboard Uh, you can you know click on the project and click on assign project and then you can click on the assignee uh, the client in this case that the account we created so just click on save and this uh, project will be assigned to I even don't need to refresh this page due to the you know stack they are working 
it will be popped up right here so here is the project now i can you know uh, work on this project from this client dashboard so this is a great system under search watch you can check it out so uh, this is a wonderful project it can give you you know daily emails for your uh, keywords you can disable the emails you can clone the project from here you can edit your project like if you don't want to use those things you can change search engine location anything from here you can also you know uh, favorite your favorite keywords right here and you can also uh, click on this button to see you can directly see its ranking you can also uh, enable or disable keyword notification from here you can give a weight to your searches by clicking here you can keep it high so it will be on the top of your list of keywords you can delete any keyword from here uh, let me show you the emails that i get on a daily basis so all these emails you will be receiving that will tell you uh, the rise upfall you know all those things about your keywords get your daily keyword notification from Surpwatch. so this is a wonderful thing so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you want to use this tool i will link the link in the description or you can also uh, you know uh, go to surfwatch.com sorry dot io and you can sign up from there so i hope uh, you like so please subscribe this channel for more videos like this till then bye have a great day